So Segway 9Bot just released this beast right here. This is the Kick Scooter G65 Max 2. And we're gonna take a look at the design, the features, the build quality, and the price, and see who this thing is for. So, let's go. Mr. Black. By the way, welcome to the channel. My name is Danny Black, and I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way. If you're new here, don't be a stranger. Click that button right there. I'll put links to everything down in the description, plus a surprise link. And on this channel, it's not my aim to get you to spend your money. I really just wanna show you what's out there, show you how it works, show you what it does, what it looks like, what it feels like, and where you can get it. And normally I would say, let's start with opening the box and see what you get, but uh, I mean, really, this is it right here. This is what's in the box. But it also does come with a power cord, a little manual, a little tube pump. And I'm not sure if this normally comes with it, but it came with mine. It's the nine bot combination lock. So we charge this thing up. You just plug it in right here. It does show you on the screen your battery charge status. It's really easy to fold and unfold. You just move this part over like this. You push down this mechanism and you bring it down to the tire. And it clips on really easily with this hook right here by the bell. I have to say that their build quality is really good. And that's because it's made from carbon steel. And because it is solid, it gives you a max weight load of 120 kilograms or 265 pounds. But it does weigh 24.4 kilograms or 53 pounds. So it's not super light, but that's also one of the things that makes it so solid and easy on the roads. And you know what, let's just get on this thing and go for a ride and I'll tell you a little bit more about the specs and features. The motors have a strong power output, 600 watt max power, and 450 watts just for normal power. The speed can get up to 25 kilometers per hour or 15.5 miles per hour, which is the legal limit. And in the deck will be the battery, and this battery has a whopping 15,300 milliamp hour battery. And that will take you 65 kilometers or 40.4 miles. That is a long distance. And because the motors are so powerful, it can go up an incline of 20%. 20% incline, no problem. The wheels are 10 inches and they're self-sealing tubeless tires, which means no more flat tires. And you'll notice that the ride is very smooth and that's because it's got a triple suspension. There's a single one in the front built in and double in the rear. And that'll make some of those speed bumps and curbs just not as harsh. This thing is waterproof. It's got a rating of IPX5, which will withstand light and moderate rain, but you know, always be cautious on rainy roads because it can be slippery. This thing is very safe, giving you a 2.1 watt LED front light to brighten up your path and a rear light so other people can see you. There is a disc brake on the front and electric brake on the rear, which will also automatically gather the energy when braking and convert it back into the battery. And it also has smart battery management system, which has six levels of protection to stop things like short circuits, overcurrents, overcharging, high temperature, low voltage, and auto sleep protection. And having that brake right there on the handlebar can just help your response time and you can stop a lot faster. And it also has this new ergonomic design. It stands up taller, the handlebars are wider, and the deck is longer. And that makes it more comfortable for you as a rider to just stand a lot more comfortably, taller, and just enjoy your ride. So let's talk about the app. The app is really cool because it's a way that you can further adjust your settings on this thing, but also you can keep track of your ride, your battery, and just see where you are on the map. You can also record your ride. Also, if you get to a spot and you don't want anyone else to take it, you can hit this little security button right there. And what that does is if someone starts moving it from that GPS location, it'll start making a very loud and unpleasant noise for them. You can keep track of all of your trips that you've done on this thing. And also there's a moments page where there's a big giant community there where people are posting different pictures and all these different things that they're doing with their scooters. So that's pretty cool. Right now, this thing comes in under 1700 Australian dollars. Like I'm in Australia right now, so I'm giving you the Australia price, but I will put links for the other countries down there in the description. And it also depends on when you're watching this because you know, prices can change and there's some deals going on and sales and coupon codes. So just check down in the description. So the other question is, who is this thing for? 
And in my opinion, I think that this is perfect for two people. One, the business person that wants to get into the city to go to work or have a meeting without having to sit in traffic or you know spend money for parking. You can take your scooter and you won't break a sweat like you would if you're taking a bike. And the other one is someone that just wants to go on joy rides. Like you get one of these and go sightseeing, cruise around the city or beach and enjoy the freedom of just getting around quickly and let it take you to places that you've never been before and probably wouldn't have gone without a scooter. But that's it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I have a lot of really cool products to share with you on this channel. So do stay tuned and see you next time. Can we call you Uncle Blanky? No. Yeah, see when I'm holding it with one hand, I have to do that because I can't clap unless I just go like through the legs. See you next time. Did that work? I think maybe.